Hello guys, welcome to uh, another video of my project uh, creating a submarine for the U-boat uh, board game from Phalanx game. So I can tell that uh, submarine is actually finished, all parts are printed and I am pretty uh, confident with all of them, uh, they look nice and so on. So whole submarine has about 93 centimeters. It's just colossal for print and it needs to be split in multiple parts. For uh, those who didn't watch uh, previous videos, this is a replacement for the paper submarine included in the game. And uh, it's 3D printed. So let me show you all the parts, including the, that which, which was not uh, in previous videos. So let's start with the front. All parts of submarines are connected by magnets, as you can see, and uh, some of the parts are removable. You can actually glue them on the on the submarine, mainly hydroplanes and propellers. This is the front of the submarine, a very small change from the previous model. They looks more like the actual submarine, mainly the uh, it's probably net uh, net knife. So let's move to the another part. This is the second part. All parts have a removable top, so you can freely access the inside of the submarine, put the uh, Kriegsmarine inside, move them freely without touching the tops, you can remove it and put next to the next to the submarine. Uh, hole for the uh, cannon and anti-air gun are included. Uh, they are 5.1 millimeters Actually, the five millimeters is uh, is the gun, and the and the anti-air gun. So you can put in there. Uh, no need for gluing them. Middle part of submarine consists from three parts. One is the cone tower. Cone tower is also uh, using magnets to connect to the to the top part of submarine. I decided to split them because it's pretty hard to print it together and a lot of mistakes happen so they are printed separately and the uh, advantage of that that you can paint it uh, by different colors. I mean tone tower you can add logo different logos if you have more more cone towers so you can actually have like different submarine. <coughs> Sorry. Again, top part is removable inside of the submarine. Magnets on both sides. Details. Aft part of the submarine. Again, top removable. Magnets, some details from the inside interior. And the final part you didn't see from previous videos, it's first time appearing. And you can see U boot U96. And my initials and on this part of submarine are again hydroplanes are removable together with propeller and uh, it consists from two parts one part is just proper on axis I will try to remove it and not to break it so uh, you need to Put it into the hole. You have this and connected to the 
a submarine. Hydroplanes, uh, there is no requirement to glue it, but the, for the propeller part, it should be glued in, in here, so it will stay there. The same applies for the for the other side. So there are two holes. You can plug the hydroplanes, and again the proper like this. That was the final part of submarine. This one uh, will be sent today or tomorrow to company who create the board game to the Poland and uh, there are some discussions about the printing of the submarine if the, uh, there will be STL files for distributing on Tinkerbells or anywhere else uh, I cannot say yes yet but we will see what will happen in the, in the in the near future maybe there will be available or I will sell just prints uh, like I said, uh, what I wanted from this project is to uh, get money for, for a new printer because my old is very obsolete and noisy and that's basically I am not doing it uh, directly for the money as I said on the, on the BGG forum so uh, that's all news for, for now and uh, I will bring uh, hopefully uh, some news next week uh, follow me on my YouTube or uh, you can discuss with me on write, uh, write me a message on the uh, board game geek and uh, I hope uh, you like all the projects thank you for watching all my videos and uh, stay tuned what will happen with this project from now on how discussion will end and uh, We'll see. I cannot promise you anything, guys. I'm sorry for that, but uh, I want want you to have uh, submarines, and uh, I think it's pretty neat to have it on the on the game as a replacement. So again, thanks you for watching, and see ya next week. Bye.